all sorts of people have an opinion about violence in society but most of those opinions are coming from people that ain't even lived this life they have no experience in the hood and they've never ever lived a day in poverty but in a school in north london there's a program going on people called mentivity they work with young men and young women um, and they discuss the issues that they face all the time We're going to split you into two, and we're going to have one group going to say ban your music, and you're going to give reasons and it's debate time, yeah? And I was going to say, no, we're not going to ban it, yeah? One two captains, say. and then you pick your team. I am one of three directors at Mentivity, a mentoring company and alternate education provision where we work with a number of young people across London. So we know what they're going to say, why they shouldn't do it, true. So can, why they shouldn't ban your music. So can we think of things that are going to counteract what they're saying? Come on, let's go. Don't try and listen in. You know so what they're saying. OK, so, the, the, so they... Drug use. Drug use, cool. Drug use and what else? The underlying um, ethos is to help young people to be the best versions of themselves. So, so it provides what? Provides job opportunities. Okay, there you go. We do things like group work sessions, one-to-one -one mentoring sessions, seminars, workshops, that sort of stuff, and helping them to kind of think critically um, and make better choices for themselves. Walking down the street and seeing a bunch of like, like people like with hoods and, and maybe like balaclavas, like everyone's got a story in it. So you don't know their story, so you can't really say like like yeah. put hella negative on them okay i play football a lot and i play around tottenham so even yesterday i came, I come home by like 9 15. it's kind of sometimes it can be scary like when i look across the world and there's gang members they look back at you you just want to turn away and just go on your bus and go home i don't like i don't like being around certain people like i know that i'll get in trouble with i always stay at the bottom of the bus all the time if you listen to Joe or you make Joe songs yourself and you say the wrong thing in the wrong area, someone's going to be on to you. It's come to that. But you can't even say a certain thing because that thing will put you in danger. Because, because in that song they're talking about how like, they killed so much people and all that. So serious crimes, yeah? Yeah. yeah. So there's association with serious crime and Joe? Yeah. Put that down, put that down. You think about it, uh, Joe has caused more successful people than more deaths. Put it down, put it down. Yeah. These days, if someone gets stabbed, no one really cares. Unless it's their family, then no one really cares. It's just another young person getting stabbed. How many of you have lost somebody kind of close to you or somebody who's been maybe sh shot, stabbed, rushed, beaten up because of involvement in a gang? How many of you have kind of had someone close to you? Loads of hands. If you're being influenced by a culture which promotes, you know, hurting somebody, taking somebody's wealth unlawfully, um, being, you know, um, rebellious to, to the law of the country just to get what you want, you know, for me is bad, it's unhelpful. And if you have a community which is facing so many social challenges, it's even more unhelpful. Violence is a choice. If 